They have a strange body odor. It smells similar to acetone. School is in session. The Mesa Police Department is teaching citizens what's behind the badge, and they're doing it at no cost to students. They have eyes that look right through you. Seniors attend in the morning. On day one, they learned all about powerful drugs like meth and ecstasy. It's like, you know, the lights are on and nobody's home. The rest of the citizens go in the evening. Class number four for them, a night tour of the PD's training facility. People signed up for a variety of reasons. Chris Ralston says learning something new keeps him and his wife sharp. Just wanted to find out how the local police department works. You know, you, you see TV shows and you see all this, but it's nice to see from the real folks. But others like Henry and Sally Saunders retired early. Maybe it was too early. So. <laughs> Their plan? To learn all they can about the PD and then hone in on an area of interest. I'm not dead yet. I like something to do to, to you know, I always like the idea of feeling like I've done something for the community. And Assistant Police Chief Mike Dvorak says everyone that attends becomes an asset to the community. 25 to 50 percent of citizens go on to volunteer. The other half, though, are, are as valuable in terms of the outreach they do in their communities. Organizers say even though money's been tight, they have no concerns that they'll have to cut the popular program. Really zero cost to the police department. So if you want to learn about almost every aspect of police work, on the way that we look at the process, call your local PD. Just don't dial 911. In Mesa, Samara Link, Cronkite News.